Hello everybody, welcome back to another Photoshop CS6 tutorial. I'm your host, Buddy Blackford, and today we're going to learn how to create a layer from a selection. And uh, this is pretty helpful because you can use the contents of one layer to um, up and apply it to another layer to essentially combine the layers in a uh, sense there. So what I'm going to show you now starts out by um, creating something such as like text or something like that or anything that you can use that has transparency in it that we can use to select. So um, go ahead and we can uh, turn our background off so we can see that there is transparency within my text here. So I'm just going to turn it back on. And what we're going to do is use a technique from the last tutorial about uh, creating a selection from a layer and apply that to this uh, tutorial. So we're going to create a selection from this layer by clicking, holding control and clicking on the thumbnail. And now our text is now selected. And you can see that here that it, uh, selected around is transparency also. Now what I want to do is I imported this picture here of a color scheme and you can see what it's going to do now it's going to take this selection here and cut out the parts uh, that are selected actually it's going to keep those parts and delete everything else it's actually not going to delete it it's actually going to make a new layer and that way it can be these certain colors that I have on here now so <clears throat> when you have uh, your thing your uh, text selected click on the layer that you want to have um, it cut out of which is for me the color scheme layer then you're gonna use the hotkey control J and it makes a copy and it's gonna put it right above the uh, actual your active layer so control J now if I turn off all my if I want to turn off all my other layers just hold down alt and click on the actual layer that we want to see which for me is called layer 2 and now you can see that this layer now um, has the colors from the color scheme layer now if I go look at the color scheme layer real quick you can see that nothing's been cut out and it's been preserved as the same image and uh, same thing with the select me text so that's how you use the um, the uh, colors or the uh, selection to create a new layer. Now you can also do this in other ways by using like selections like that. So let's uh, turn off this layer and then we'll bring uh, up the color scheme layer again. And I'm going to go over here to the pen tool here and click on it. And what I'm going to do is just draw out a selection for us real quick. The pen tool is able to make selections. So click on it and just drag to make some lines that will make us a selection or something like that. There we go. And click on this uh, selection button up here in the pen tool options where it says make and then click selection. And then hit OK and now we have a new selection that's been made now we get, all we have to do is um, make sure we're on color scheme for our active layer and then control J hockey and now we have created this little um, boomerang looking thingy here so that's how uh, another way you can use it you can use your selection your square selection tools or rectangular you can use your lasso to draw out your own selection if you would want if you wanted to and all that kind of stuff now you can make a quick copy of an entire layer if you wanted to um, by using the move tool and we can use the move tool to just like uh, drag out another copy for example this is how it works and it created a whole another copy but I want to just add uh, some more stuff to it so I want to have this select me over here and I'm going to just merge these two layers together by having them both selected right clicking and clicking on merge layers so now we know we have two different uh, things now combined into this one layer so if you have the move tool selected and you hold down alt and you drag out it's going to copy everything that you had in that layer just like that 
Now, this is a quicker way than going through and selecting everything and then trying to make a, a, another copy out of it that way. So that's how um, moving that out. It's just like a little quick tip that I'm throwing in there. Uh, another w way to do this is to um, select a layer and then hit Control and then J to um, move the layer. Now, my favorite thing, or hold or the hotkey control J isn't really my favorite thing because I can barely reach over there with uh, one hand so I have to use two hands and um, I don't really like switching to two hands when I'm working so um, I like the holding all and moving the um, move tool a lot better than that so that's uh, my tutorial on creating a layer from a selection and I added some bonus stuff in there for you so Hopefully you guys can use this information on your uh, upcoming projects or anything like that. So thanks for watching this one. Um, thanks for watching the series up till now if you have. And if you're just jumping in now just to check out this tutorial, thanks for even checking me out. So have a good one, everybody. Subscribe for more. See you later.